Black and White Network supporters, make sure you check out the Black and White Network merchandise store. Link in the description. Use promo code USA First, all one word. USA First, all one word. 25% off now. Well, guys, we are less than two months away from the 2022 midterm elections. And this is a big election here because the House and the Senate could actually flip from blue to red. Now, when it comes to the Senate, technically, guys, there's actually um more Republicans in the Senate than Democrats. But however, the two independents actually caucus with uh, Democrats. So therefore, 50-50 and Kamala Harris is the tiebreaker. Now, we know that Mitch McConnell is doing everything that he can to ensure that Republicans don't actually win the Senate. But there's one important race in the Senate, and that is actually in Georgia, where the socialist, the fake pastor, Raphael Warnock, who actually supports abortion, and this man's supposed to be a Christian, uh, he's going gonna go ahead and uh, face off against former NFL great Herschel Walker. Now, this summer, man, the media really did try to smear Herschel Walker, and uh, when it came down to the polls, I believe initially Herschel Walker was actually leading, and then during the summer, the polls started flipping for uh, the socialist Raphael Warnock. Now, guys, we got some new data here because um, we actually found that found out that um, in the previous poll that Herschel Walker was actually in the lead. And now, guys, he has expanded that lead leading up to the midterms here. Over here on Fox News, Herschel Walker closes gap with Senator Warnock now leads by three points in Georgia Senate poll. Now, this, I believe, is going to be a tight race and it possibly could end up going uh, to a runoff election like we actually saw in uh, 2021. Hopefully it doesn't actually get to that. But um, let's go ahead and read some of this, guys. The Senate race in Georgia appears to be shifting back in the GOP's favor, according to a new poll that shows Herschel Walker, also endorsed, endorsed by uh, Trump, by the way, as the favorite to uh, win in the midterm election over incumbent Raphael Warnock, Democrat Socialist from Georgia. An insider advantage Fox 5 Atlanta poll released Thursday suggests Walker has taken the lead in the Georgia race, one of the mostly closely uh, watched Senate races in the nation, with the football legend receiving 47 percent support from voters in the Peach State over Warnock's 44 percent support. The latest poll shows a two point uh, increase for Walker and a four-point decrease in Warnock's support since a July poll, a major shift in the race just two months before the midterm elections. Yeah, because I believe that um, Warnock had a four-point lead, and now he's down by three. That That's a seven-point swing right there. That's pretty big. Uh, Walker shared, on Wednesdays, shared, shared Wednesday on Fox News' Hannity why he believes he is getting a boost above his Democrat opponent in several recent polls. Uh, quote, the reason is I'm getting out and meeting the people and I'm talking to the people and the people are speaking. You know, they spent over $50 million against me, but the race is still tied. Walker told host Sean Hannity. Walker went on to highlight why he feels Georgia is in need of new Senate leadership. Quote, people want a change in Washington. Senator Warnock is a, a cut from the cloth of Joe Biden. Yeah, he is. And what I mean by that is he believes in higher taxes. He believes in open borders. He voted to put men in women's sports. This man's supposed to be a Christian, guys, a preacher. And that's not what the Georgian people want, Walker said. The Georgian people want someone they can trust and they can trust in Herschel Walker. Now, anybody that's actually supporting these socialists out there that are actually trying to destroy women's sports, by the way, and want, want women, want men, I should say, in women's bathrooms and call yourself a Christian pastor? Nah, no, something's wrong with that. Uh, Raphael Warnock supports abortion. He probably supports uh, transitioning children as well. Unbelievable. It says here, quote, Warnock is winning among younger voters. That's not really too much of a surprise. 
and seniors, but trails badly among those 40 to 64. Men support Walker at 60 percent, while women support Warnock at 55 percent. Walker is receiving 12 percent support from African-American respondents. I don't know why these black people keep voting Democrat. Why? I have no idea. Set insider advantage on Chairman uh, Matt Towery alongside the poll results. Quote, with only 4% undecided, this race could very well be headed to a general election runoff, given the fact that there seems to be a few points among the various demographics up for grabs. After months of going back and forth, Warnock agreed to debate Walker in October. Uh, the poll also shows um, Democratic gubernatorial nominee and former state rep Stacey Abrams is trailing incumbent Governor Brian Kemp in the race for the governor's mansion. Uh, Kemp leads in every age group in the survey. He receives right at uh, 10 percent of uh, African-American support, which is roughly about um, the average on support for uh, black people when it comes to Republicans. And a rather astounding 68 percent of white voters surveyed. Abrams has an impressive 54 percent of female voters, while Kemp receives 63 percent from men. So there you have it, guys. That is the latest update. Herschel Walker expands his lead in the poll. And um, this this is very, very important, guys. Georgia is very, very important because when it came to the 2020 election, Georgia was key. It was key for everything that unfolded in um, 2020. Now, would Georgia voters wake up and not vote the way they did before or Will they just um, say, hey, you know what? We like what Beijing Biden's doing. We like Raphael Warnock actually supporting abortion. We like that Raphael Warnock wants um, men and women's bathrooms. I don't think people should actually be supporting stuff like that. But that's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white network fans. Let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. And we'll catch you next time.